be tricky. So, you know the cur? Yeah. That's like... So. Yeah, it's like a s sound in um, this word. So it's... And then a is actually a in that word. So try and turn that out. Um, what do you say when something's really old? It's a. Um, hmm. What are dinosaurs? Uh, reptiles. <laughs> ancient. Do you know what ancient, ancient. means? Yeah. Yeah, real. ancient. That's ancient. Roman, Roman times about. 2,000 years ago. Well done. Mm. But at least you're here. I got things to tell you, so just sit there. There's no one else. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Daddy. Okay. I'm going to miss you. Yeah, and have a nice time. Yeah. You've got everything. You've got Teddy, haven't you? Yeah, no, You've yeah, got your bag. Yeah. yeah. Have a nice time. I miss you. Miss you. Bye. Now, unless you're Saturday the 12th of May and we are a man down today. Bill's gone to go and see his dad. He'll be back tomorrow evening and that means as a result this vlog is going to be one fifth less good because we've lost one fifth of our family member today but oof, Stanley is still a little bit under the weather. It comes and goes at the moment. He's like coughing up a lot of mucus, so he's on the mend, but it's just that awkward part. But yeah, we've come out to go to Nando's for lunch, really, and just have a mooch, because otherwise we'll be stuck inside all day. One thing they will promise they're building you a throne If only you had seen They won't leave the truth alone And now you can see the world But you're blinded by the light Leading you from reason And straight into the night Now don't believe him He's a liar and a sugar cook William's not here, is he? Nana. He's not gone Nana, it's no baby. He's gone to see his his daddy. Oh, do you miss him? Yeah. Yeah, I miss him too, babe. Is that funny? Just wait until break of dawn. What you have to say, but don't forget to leave the motor on. He'll turn around. 
So we are home now. It's Keith to stay in my hair because I've just taken the clip that was keeping it neat out because I've got a headache. Does anyone else get that? You know when you like have your hair up for too long and then yet yeah, your hair roots hurt, don't they? Or is that just me? I hope it's not just me because if it is then I'll probably need to see a doctor. But we have hit some sort of strange stroke of luck by which both the children are asleep. Daisy fell asleep in the car as did Stanley and even though when Mark tried to move it she woke up we were able to sort of get her to go to bed in her car so that was well I mean it's quite nice we never normally get like quiet time like this anymore with three of them obviously like with Bill not being here it, it does make it a lot quieter <laughs> um but yeah I am folding some laundry and we've got a Tesco delivery coming between I think it's like three and four and then I think we're just kind of like hunker down for the night is that saying i think it's a thing but yeah we're just gonna chill tonight i think because i don't know we do wander around at the weekend sometimes when bill's not here and we're like we don't actually know what to do with ourselves because he just sort of makes everything fit i don't know it's funny when i do these vlogs i am um, i do chatty bits like this and then i feel this immense pressure to be interesting and then the more I talk, the more I realise I'm not, I'm not very interesting at all. It's funny really, like I, I never really intended to do this as a job. I just liked making videos and it was like a progression from when I used to write on my blog and like take photos and stuff. I just started picking up a camera one day and capturing like little moments and that was back when I had like 100 subscribers and then now it's like I'm nearly at 30 I think and that's not masses by any means but um it's a lot to me and i don't know i just think it's really weird that this is what i do like and i i don't think that i really warrant the amount of followers and subscribers that i have sometimes yeah it's just a it's a weird job to do i've always said though that i'm gonna ride this train until i have to get off and then i'll go back and have a normal normal job and um just enjoy it while it lasts. I have no desire to be famous or a millionaire. I just want to be at home with my kids for now and work hard and, you know, live a comfortable but ordinary life. Um, I don't even know why I'm telling you this, to be honest, but there you go. Sometimes I walk alone at night when everybody else is sleeping. I think of him and then I'm happy with the company I'm keeping. The city goes to bed and I can live inside my head on my own, pretending he's beside me. Without him, I feel his arms around me And when I lose my way, I close my eyes And he's found me In the rain, the pavement shines like silver You got that night? Nice. Yeah. yeah. Are you going to be a good girl and go to sleep and not wake up until nine in the morning? Yeah! Daisy, Daisy, <laughs> eating sugar, <laughs> telling lies, <laughs> open your mouth. <laughs> Love you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yes? No, no, no. Oh, I love you forever. <laughs> no night, princess.
Yeah, hot. Good girl. Hot eye. Woo! <laughs> Should we get your plate? What a beautiful morning. I played Laurie in that once many moons ago. It's the last show I did before I had kids actually, so it was like the year before I had Bill. Anyway, um, we have just been pottering around this morning and now we are going for a little walk in the sun. I want to get a nice coffee from Costa, but anyway, I'm off to enjoy this sunshine. Do you feel that I'm your missing part? That you're finally right? Daisy and Stanley are in the garden. We've had to put Stanley in like the corner in the shade, but I feel really bad because he's like on his own on his little playmat. He's happy as anything, but you forget how tricky it is when you've got a newborn because you can't do the same things, can you? You've always got to make sure you've got shade and that sort of thing. And it's made me realize that when we go on holiday, which is in three weeks, that we're gonna have to rethink the way we do things a little bit because I've never been with a newborn before. So if you've got any traveling with a newborn, going on holiday somewhere hot with a newborn tips, then let me know. I'm just making myself a little gin. This is the Aldi gin, quite like it. I think it's won an award, which is always good. Um, I'm measuring it out because Slimming World. But yeah, I like to have a drink at the weekend. Makes me happy, just have a little beverage or two. Um, come on, every last drop out of this jug. Come on. <laughs> I have some cucumber in mine. Really gotten into drinking gin with like slices of cucumber in. I don't know what I'm playing out really because I'm certainly not posh. Just need to go and get some tonic water one sec. Back. I am um, I got myself a little bottle of Prosecco from Aldi earlier. You know one of the mini ones? Because if I open a big one, I'll drink it all and that's not so more friendly. But I might actually hit 30,000 subscribers today. Might. I'm hoping I do. At the moment, I have six left. So if you're one of those 29,994 people, I love you very much. Thank you. <laughs> but it's a really big deal for me. I got to 20,000 on New Year's Eve, I think it was. Yeah, it was. So it was like last day of 2017. And now it's taken me just under five months or like four and a half months to get with the 10,000 which is like that's amazing I can't actually believe it and um, be right back I need some ice Ooh. so that's me sorted but yeah I'm just I'm feeling really excited and if I get to 30 I'm gonna like treat that as like you know back when I had a normal job if you get to a, a milestone in your career or you get promoted or something you would celebrate wouldn't you so I'm trying to celebrate with a teeny tiny bottle of Prosecco um so hopefully that happens today because I would just be really really made up um it's a weird one on YouTube because obviously it's not about the numbers deep down it's about like the kind of people that you you have around you like you're all so lovely and everyone says that your vibe attracts your tribe and I love the tribe that I'm a part of although that is a bit of a corny thing to say isn't it but I do and um it, it doesn't matter to me day to day that I'm not got like I don't know 200 million thousand whatever um but then when i think of it from like a work perspective if i don't 
grow and I don't like do well then I won't be able to earn money because I won't be the sort of person that brands want to work with so you do kind of have to keep it in the back of your mind and then um, you just gotta keep up with everyone else and it's quite hard sometimes because you're getting judged on like your personality so you're you're as successful as you are likable does that make sense like what kind of job is that <laughs> it's so weird um but yeah i'm rambling but i'm gonna go and sit outside for a bit bill is going to be home in two hours and the stew that i was preparing this morning i think i shared a shot of it um i put in the oven now in a big oven proof like casserole dish type thing and that will be done around the same time that he gets home and i'm just going to do some mashed potato with it as well um it's just a shame that that's what i've chosen to cook on a day like today because nothing says hot weather like a big steaming bowl of beef with gravy and vegetables does it i mean like we should have had a barbecue but i'm not very good at planning so there you go i lose my breath whenever i see you you stole my heart what is it that you do I'm so excited, I'm so so chuffed. Thank you if you are watching this and you're one of those people because I honestly wouldn't be able to do this without you. Ladies and gents, this is the moment you put it for. Oh. Oh, that was really anticlimactic. I thought it might pop. Just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. Please tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. You set my world on fire. You set my world on fire. Dinner's ready. I don't know. That you do. My life was great till you added color. 